What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, this video, I'm going to make y'all a quick eight. It's going to be quick, straight to the point. And I'm here to speak on uh, some of the ladies yesterday had an issue with the blast from the past. It wasn't such a blast for y'all uh, with Blueface and Krishan. And that's okay. Um, because what's understood don't necessarily have to be explained to us because for some reason they understand something that we don't. Now, what I want to put out there before I even get into them two is this. I have been asked to make more positive content. Why don't you make more positive content? And I'm going to answer with simply this. On the internet... If y'all haven't noticed, it's been NFL players, NBA players, old rappers, new rappers, um, and everyone and their mother speaking about drama, right? The majority of the internet is drama. The majority of the news is drama. The majority of any platform that has anything to do with people has drama with it. So with that being said, before I came along, before I touched any computer, girl, we had love and hip hop. You had bad girls, all right? You had Jersey Shore. I mean, my grandma didn't have cable, baby, and I bought the DVDs because we used to love Jersey Shore, and I still love Pauly D, all right? With that being said, today, Ray J spent 70, that's a lie. He is about to get paid $75 million for his company, Raycon uh, headphones to take that 75 million and create a new uh, said platform, which will be a network. And that network will consist of trauma. We have Zeus. We have now that's TV and we now will have Tronics and we actually have more. Stunned girl just started home network and hell Natalie should too, but that's a whole nother conversation. What I am simply saying is if you want to watch something that is informational, inspirational, baby, you got to get it somewhere else. Now, to those that want to talk about inspirational things, because nothing is wrong with speaking about inspirational things, because if y'all haven't noticed, I speak about inspirational things through the drama. You either going to catch it or you're not. But see, we listen to and we hear what we want to hear and listen to. So with that being said, um, if you don't get that, this ain't the channel for you. I'm going to let you know right now. My grandma used to, rest in peace to my grandma, y'all. I used to come in her house from outside smelling like outside because you know they'll tell you, you smell just like outside. And you want to know what she was doing? Looking out the window. She knew I was coming in before I even came in. And she knew that because she was looking at that neighbor, the neighbor over there, neighbor over there. She got a window at the back door. She looking at the back neighbors. Come my grandma with nosy. Gussie May, she was nosy. Rest her soul, Lord. And I'm going to tell you right now, I get it from her. <laughs> I get it from her and a lot of us get it from our grandmothers. This has not uh, been a thing that is of the past. This isn't a new thing. This has been going on for time and time again. The news outlets are drama. Mm -hmm. The newspaper drama you know actually i feel like the news in the newspaper is so bad because all they speak about is everybody that is no longer here anymore okay so i at least talk about the people that is here and i talk about the ones that's they might be whooping some ass today they might be loving on each other tomorrow my point is you're not running away from it it is 2024 some of the things that y'all might find disturbing crazy and outlandish will forever show up on your timeline if that's what you decide to watch. So I advise you to watch something different. Now, for the nosy people that like to watch stuff with me, this is for you. On Patreon, we're about to go to some Now That's TV content. All right? Yesterday, Shamar hit a woman in the face. What is wrong with him? Who knows? We're going to watch it today. I'll tell you that damn shit, and I'm putting it on the Patreon. All right? That was just a quick intermission. My Patreon will be in the pinned comment. I will be reacting to a lot of episodes, uh, excuse me, series on Now That's TV. Had no idea it was this many series. I'm looking at it right now. It's a lot. So we're going to get into that content. I'm going to make sure this Patreon is going to be top tier for y'all. But 
let me address the whole um I'm what do they say? What 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 y'all call it? Um basically saying that it's a good thing for Krishan to get Paul's put on her by Blueface. Um glamorizing it. That was the word. Now, for those that don't catch my positivity in the in in this content, if you don't catch the positivity, at least catch uh what I tell y'all to do if a man ever put his hands on you because no man putting their hands on me and I'm gonna be like, thanks. That was a great hit. Daddy. You know what I'm saying? That <laughs> no. See, I am the queen of Glock. I love Glockianas. I am not a Smith and Weston type of girl. And I don't like none of them other ones either. Glock me. Okay. And for those that don't know, and the any state with an open fire arm or whatever you want to call it open carry i live in those states and i have to because i can't live in a state that i can't have one so with that being said by any means necessary i am a woman that will protect myself from anything and anybody and i let everyone know that they should do the same see when we were reacting to this type of content and Blueface was doing that and we were just feeling so bad. Like, oh, my God, why the hell would Krishan put up with this? And we, I mean, even today, it's like, damn, Krishan, why would you? Krishan said, I don't care what y'all talking about. She not leaving that man. Mm -hmm. She's going to stay with him. She cool with getting hit, and she cool with hitting him. They are the new Bobby and Whitney, believe it or not, like it or not. Bobby and Whitney are legends. I know y'all don't like it, but them two fools going to be legends. <laughs> they are. <laughs> They're already legendary. The internet is a bore without Blueface. Sorry. Um, Krishan ain't, ain't making no noise because she want to do it with him. Okay. So with that being said, um, I don't support nobody putting hands on nobody. And I feel as though whoever put hands on who should get Paul's back put on them. Period. Okay, um, I, I can't lie. After, you know, on, on one of the episodes that I reacted to on my Patreon on uh, Crazy in Love, uh, Blueface put paws on Krishan, and Krishan took a Hennessy bottle and went straight across his head with it. That was probably one of the happiest times I've ever had when it came to reacting to them, too, because uh, I don't think he should be putting his hands on her at all. I don't think she should be putting her hands on him either, because she do that a lot. Okay? Um, also, I feel as though if a woman put their hands on a man, um, I think a man should be able to defend himself. Does he have to put all his strength and all his might? No. But you're not about to keep hitting me, okay? And if I had a son, you're not going to keep hitting my son. And I know a lot of y'all have sons. Y'all get it. So with that being said, listen, if you want informational, motivational, inspirational content, I think you should create it yourself, to create a YouTube channel, I'm about to give y'all some sauce. All you got to do is uh, make a Google. Hit YouTube. Create an at. You got a channel. I think some of y'all should do inspirational things. I do. I do. And I'm not being funny because for some reason, I think that y'all think that some people don't like certain drama or they're not intrigued by certain things. I don't know what y'all be thinking, but I'm going to tell you, if I react to it, I'm into it. Okay? Um, I don't want neither one of them putting hands on each other, but that's what they like to do. Is that going to stop me from watching them? Uh-uh. So I don't know who needed that warning or who needed to know if they needed to go somewhere else. Listen, baby, I understand. I understand. But my parents enjoy Bobby and Whitney and still do. A lot of them still listen to their music. And, um, yeah, it is what it is. It's everything ain't for everybody. But for those that it's for, I'm about to get that now. Uh, now that's TV. I'm about to put some of that on the Patreon. Y'all can go watch Crazy in Love on my Patreon. You can go watch um, Baddies on my Patreon. You can go watch the seasons of Baddies on my Patreon. You can go watch the reunions of Baddies on my Patreon. I think Bad Boy's on there too. We just getting started. We about to get this shit popping. So I love y'all. All right. Any woman that um, has gone through... Uh, somebody putting paws on them. Yeah, I don't support that at all. And I, you know, we go back and forth of what y'all should do, what you shouldn't do, how y'all feel in the moment. You, Some of y'all are afraid to, things like that. I don't even like to get too deep into it because it's too damn personal. It's too personal. It really is. But I just feel as though if something triggers you 
or it bothers you, you really shouldn't watch it. And I'm not being funny. You shouldn't. So if it bothers you, like, y'all, stop watching. For real. If, if, if you don't enjoy it and it brings you some type of discomfort or whatever, stop watching this shit. But this is going to go on. This type of content is the new age. And see, I, go, I roll with the times. So that's all I got. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. That's all I have. Um, love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.